hey guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm filming March 4th to March 10th and I'm finally getting around to using the Kirsten kit from Scribble Prince Co I feel like I've been sitting on this kit forever and a day um so yeah I'm just gonna go through the kit it's like one of the older mini kit formats I think yeah it is actually so it's pretty exciting um it was really hard for me to like sort of like bring out the colors I suppose like to find a washi for it and everything it's got the old washi the old box here with the cut lines in it which is exciting because like I don't actually have to use like the little um washi tape here but I did bring it out anyway and the glitter headers and then you've got the bow sheet and the really old like once more with love freebie and I've pulled in to go with it the dusty rose um, with the rose gold bow um, and this was the 2.0 release from the full pre-sale this last year uh, mid last year so because I'm really unorganized and this is the second plan with me I filmed this week because um, last week's video was delayed what I'm gonna do is put the base down and then I'm gonna go organize like all my foils and stuff and then I'm probably gonna come back like that for you guys I can't click at the moment since I've had my Botox <laughs> In my hands um in a split second for you guys which will probably be like hours later for me um and with my foils and stuff organized for you guys because i do think i'm going to pull in the rose gold in this kit and i don't have a lot of rose gold so i'm probably going to run myself off some of that and bring that in which is why i've pulled in the rose gold bow which was really hard for me to do because i don't actually buy a lot of the rose gold bows from simply gilded they're just not really my jam um, neither is rose gold like I don't like working with the foil as much either like <laughs> it's just not my thing like I don't know anyway so we're just gonna like start laying it down I suppose and still my thing I suppose um yeah anyway so how's your week been for you guys it'll be a whole week since you've heard me and seen me and everything like that and all the fun stuff so I'm not organized at all as you can tell I don't think I want that ruler at the moment. I need another one. Oh, pick a ruler. Any ruler. So yes, uh, last night was interesting. Um, if you were following my Instagram last week, which was last night for me, um, I posted like going out with a thunder bang on my Instagram, which was um, it was the end of summer last night, 28th of February for Australians, and um. We had this massive summer storm. Massive. So it was very much like summer storms for us are very dry. There was a little bit of rain, but it was mostly a fairly dry storm. Very patchy rain. But the heaps and heaps of lightning, which was kind of scary almost because it was fork lightning. So it was touching the ground. Um, and it was setting fires off everywhere. Um, so there was this um, massive, massive, like a lot of lightning that set fires off. Um, in a whole stack of scrubland fairly close to my house actually uh, which was next to the highway <laughs> and the train line um, so they were on top of that pretty damn quickly and they even cancelled the trains for a while while they were getting on top of it and um, yeah that was pretty pretty scary it was um, they were asking for dash cam footage actually to see if anybody could like if they could figure out like where it, and all that kind of stuff like the media were obviously the fire is well like, yeah whatever we don't care um it's all sorted from our end so anyway but yeah that was the excitement of the night i suppose um see i had trouble matching a washi to this probably because like it's a real like light blue taupey color i was like shoot like what washi am i gonna actually put with this and then I was like, ah, oh, the dusty rose gold or whatever it is. I'm like, that will do. It's close enough, but different. Because I don't buy the um, 15 millimeter stickers from Scribble Prince Co. Because I'm like, oh, I just don't use them. Like, I don't see the point. Like, if I want to make a sticker, I can make a sticker. Like, it's not that big a deal. Like, yes, my printer hates me a lot of the time, but so be it. That actually cut not really. I was saying last in last week's video, I need to buy a new slice tool. My slice tool and I are not getting along overly well at the moment. That's better. Get them on. There we go. Um, 
I find with this method, some people were saying that it gets stuck to their planner. If you don't like stick it down to your planner, like if you only run your finger across the top part of your washi and then you go back and put it down after it's cut, I find that it doesn't stick and then it doesn't rip your paper. The only one that does it is the caress press one because it's such a, an evil little piece of sticker paper. Um, so if you do it using the Scribble Prints Co one, and I'm assuming other glossy kits rather than matte kits would even be the same. Um, if you don't stick it down, you just like sit it there, then you won't have the issue with it like sticking as much. Like if you don't apply pressure to it. So the only part I run my I run my finger across at the top, and then I don't actually put pressure on the bottom part. I just let it like sit there, and then I obviously like when I'm putting the ruler down don't put pressure on the part that I'm cutting off. I find that helps me a bit with the whole like not sticking bit. But yeah, so that was my excitement for the night. Um, yeah, see then it's just lifted away cleanly. Except that little bit that decided to rip on the sticker, but that's okay, I'll fix that. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, I've been saying all week that I really need to study and um, I haven't yet so hopefully like by the time this video goes up I've actually studied. For those who are wondering what I'm studying, um, I've done my bachelor's degree and all that which is great, woohoo, go me. And I studied in that field for about five years and I got sick and then I just decided that yeah cool I can't really be bothered going back into that field. So I'm retraining, retraining lightly, use that term and um, I'm doing a business certificate obviously which will help me in my Etsy shop and all that um, but having done a bachelor's degree like a certificate in like TAFE so like back training under training it's actually really boring and um yeah I'm just gonna put my full boxes down now it's actually really boring and really tedious and the quality of the presentation of the work is actually really, really badly structured. And if I handed that quality of work out to like my high school students, like years ago, like I would have had it thrown back at me and been like, this is a joke, right? You're kidding me. Like you wouldn't hand this crap out to kids. So, um, yeah, I'm just a bit disappointed, shall we say that I'm paying for this, like with my own money. And, uh, yeah, it's such poor quality. <laughs> So I'm just going to sort of whack these boxes down anywhere because they don't really have that much significance. I'm just trying to figure out which box I'm going to put as the full box. Excuse me. I've got a bit of a runny nose this morning and nothing is fixing it. I'm going to put like the... I'm going to put that on coffee on Monday. Coffee Monday. Thinking about maybe putting the, the bag as the the box that might work I'm thinking about putting like one of these different patterns here to break up the white background so anyway I'm just yeah really disappointed and like the and it's a national course too like it's not even like it's just like my state it's like a nationally based course that is why I'm like really disappointed in the layout like each like like institution basically just like takes it and copies and pastes it and puts their own header on it basically and I'm like yeah you guys like really suck and they basically just like import it into their own system and I'm like yeah guys that's really bad um coffee monday fashion girl that yeah that works So it's, it's tedious is very, and it, I find it very hard to study things that I'm not remotely interested in. Like it's all very much common sense. And I have a lecturer who's very much into like, you need to give very detailed answers on like all of these things. And I'm like, I'm running out of detailed answers to give you with apart from telling you that the whole course is bullshit and you should just pass me because I'm amazing. <laughs> No, um, I've done the certificate two already. I did that years ago, like while I was already studying because I was bored and a glutton for punishment. Um, and she wouldn't credit a single thing. And I'm like, love, I deserve at least like half of this course credited already. She's like, no, 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 you have to do the whole thing again. I'm like, even the workplace health and safety, she's like, oh yes, there's been lots of changes. I'm like, well, can you credit me like half the course? Then can I just do like part of that module? And she's like, no, 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 you have to do the whole module. I'm like, you're kidding me. <laughs> So I had to do like, I have to do like the whole thing again. And I'm like, this is so tedious. 
So I'm really, really peeled about that. And I'm halfway through it and I'm just like, yeah, this is really, really frustrating me. If you can't already tell, I'm really annoyed about it. And I chose this kit because it's the start of when the start of autumn and like, yeah, cool little weather. And I'm like, heat wave. Yeah. So yeah, not impressed at all. Color flag, should I do yours? Thinking about bringing in like that lilac color because it's really cute and dainty. And it just breaks it up a bit. So I'm a little peered about that. So I'm gonna go lay the glitter headers and I will be right back. Okay, the glitter headers are done and oh my god, I've, I've missed Girl Prince Co Kids so much. Like, I haven't been buying as many like of anything lately and I don't know, you guys have probably noticed that. I just, there's been a lot of anytime kids coming out and there's been a lot of anytime artwork coming out and not that us artists fold at all. Oh, by the way, sorry if you can hear my fan in the background. Um, it's going to be another hot day and I really don't feel like dying. Um, I just haven't been digging the anytime art from anybody, like regardless of who's put it together. And I just, I've tried, been trying to like cut back my spending, which includes like buying anytime artwork from anybody. So um, yeah, I've just not been buying it. And that's going to hit me hard when it comes to like having kids for anything. But you know what? Like, oh well. Um, I've just been very like selective about artwork and like the purpose of me using the artwork and all that kind of thing. So, but yeah, I've definitely missed her kids, her art, like just, just the everything about it really. I've really missed it. So yeah, I will definitely be savoring it a lot closer. And I need to go back and find where I've used on dinners. But yeah, I've definitely missed it. Um, and it's not even the, the cost. It is part of the reason of the cost, but also the, um, just the, the anytime factor, like the artwork, like I just, I don't want to use like a random looking kit, like in the middle of winter that says, Hey, I look like summer, you know, it just doesn't do it for me. Like, yes, I want my planner to be pretty, but I also want it to sort of represent the season I'm in or the mood that I'm feeling, and it doesn't do it for me. What else do I want to do? Do I want, like, a box there? No, I don't, because I'm not really reading a book. I finished the Outlander series, and I can't buy, bring myself to buy any other books. Um, I might put, like, two of the little boxes, though. And we might put a work one and a to-do one and I might use the work one in related to Etsy and the to-do one in related to just like general stuff for the week yeah that might work that'll work well okay so I need some more washi and I think I'm going to use the two middle size pieces now and like layer the headings the headers over them this just put them in the middle so that's been my biggest dilemma lately is just the actual cost and I know there's like people like oh buy within your own country and I have been you guys just haven't seen those kits come up yet that's all it's literally been and the fact that Australia Post really sucks <laughs> that is so not in the line <laughs> Yes, Birdie, I hear you. I hear you indeed. So, yeah, that's pretty much all it is. Like, the fact that I just haven't... That's not going to fit. No, it's not. I'm just going to have to chop the box. That's okay. So what I'm going to do is chop the, the box here into two. There is a tiny line there. And yeah, so 
I have been buying more Australian like kits and stuff, but I just miss the quality of school Prince Co. Like her, that's a little crooked. Oh well. I was just something about her like not only her paper quality, like I can almost match that, but it's just her print quality that I miss. There we go. And that one there. Again, crooked, goodness me. I know you guys don't come here to watch me lay stickers down straight because like I can't do that. And if you did, well, see you later. <laughs> oh dear. There we go, that's a little better. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. I'm just gonna go and put my TV shows across the bottom and then that's pretty much it for now. And then I'll come back in like then <laughs> and show you the rest of it later. Um, because I haven't got any enough stickers out here to organize the rest of me. Yeah, no, I haven't. <laughs> I'm just looking at my list in front of me and I do not. So I've got one, two, three, four TV shows on Monday. And they are, if you would care to know, Call the Midwife, Heartland, When Calls the Heart and Shameless. And yes, I know, I am the worst, sappiest person in the world, I know. I'm just going to get my tweezers to put these down because they make life a little bit easier for me. And then on Tuesday, I have two TV shows and they are The Resident and The Good Doctor. And how, I'm just going to say, how bad is the acting getting in The Good Doctor? Like, seriously, how bad is it getting? Um, but seriously, how good is The Resident? <laughs> it's a good pair. Um, yes, like that show. And then on Wednesday, we have three TV shows. And if you're, one, if you're from overseas and you're like wondering why they're, all the TV shows are on different days, it's because of the way they air and like with the different time zone. That's why they're all a day out of whack. <laughs> And then um, there's Wednesday is three and it's This Is Us, New Amsterdam and Schitt's Creek. Um, and yes, I am still watching uh, Married at First Sight, but I'm sort of watching it here and there because like sometimes I just read, for those who are Australian, James Weir Craps, um, James Weir, sorry, his like um, daily updates on the news, on the internet because they're just as good. Um, and Thursday, only Riverdale's on, the Chicago's on, on, on. Thursday apparently <laughs> or went on on Thursday yeah James Weir recaps are just as good <laughs> so yeah <laughs> actually sometimes I think they're better than the actual show themselves and then Friday I have one two three five oh there's new shows starting um Grey's The Big Bang Theory Young Sheldon Station 19 and For the People I don't even remember what For the People is about. I'm going to have to go watch the last... I'm going to have to go find the highlights of the last season on YouTube and watch that again. I can't be the only one that has that issue, right? No. Right? <laughs> um, get there, you turd. Okay. Alright. I'm going to leave it at this at the moment. And in the blink of an eye, I will be back. The blink of an eye with the rest of my stickers and um to finish you off and i'm back just like that it's been like five or so hours um and i've done like six weeks worth of study in that time so i'm having a study break and i'm gonna do some planning so i've pulled out my rose gold foil which isn't a lot but i'm also really lazy and i can't be bothered cutting anymore so i'm just gonna like creative I suppose you say what I'm thinking about doing is with like these speckle headers it's just using like half of it and just like slicing it just to cover like the bottom bit and not the washi not that you can really see what I'm doing because like we've got stuff in the way everywhere I've got cords running everywhere because I've got like different things plugged in now than I did earlier um so yeah that's what I'm thinking about doing um yeah so I'm gonna get a head start on that I don't know how this is gonna turn out by the way it could be an absolute disaster but we're gonna roll with it <laughs> Um, yeah, so I did like heaps of study in that time frame and um, I also like was saying pulled out my foil and I had more gold foil than I thought which was kind of nice but yeah I just can't be bothered pulling any more out and um, cutting anymore or anything like that I figured I'd work with what I've got and if I don't have it then it's not meant to be 
because I haven't done any like water processing at all today. I thought I'm just gonna get as much TAFE done as I can today and start up again tomorrow with like a clear head to finish as much of it as I can, I suppose you'd say. Because I wanna get as this unit done and dusted so I can give myself some time off in between my classes. Good lord, really? Get off there. Sorry, I didn't mean to say that. If that offended anybody, I apologize. Um, yeah, so I want to put some time off in between. I actually emailed, actually emailed my lecturer and I'm like, um, are you sure this isn't a repeat of like last year's last course? And she's like, yeah, I promise it's not. She's like, they are very similar though. I'm like, yeah, no kidding. Um, yeah, so, because she emailed me a few days ago and she's like, oh, if you have any trouble, let me know. And I said to her, I said, yeah, I will. If I have any troubles, this isn't slicing. What the actual fuck? I'd have if I used it the right way, hey? Yep, that's my fail of the day. <laughs> it's like, there's something like stopping it from cutting there. Okay, I think it was just me having to stop talking to make it work. Righto, so that sort of worked, I suppose. Um, I do have 15mm washi available now. Um, I just, like I said, I couldn't be bothered, honestly. I just could not be bothered going to cut it for myself and print it off and all that hula. So, yeah, I'm just going to make do. Yeah, so I smashed it out and she's like, I noticed you uploaded a heap of work just then. She's like, I see you got your motivation. I'm like, yeah, well, I suppose if I do it all now, I can have some time off for the next course, can't I? She's like, yeah, pretty much. She's like, unless you want me to upload the next one early. And I'm like, no, thank you. <laughs> so anyway, I'm just going to like lift this a bit so it doesn't stick as much. Anyway, um... As I said on my personal Facebook, um, the only thing I'm learning how to do with this in, in this course is keep my word processing formatting skills fresh and how to uh, copy and paste from the uh, document and change the font because it is the worst course ever. That second time went a lot smoother now that I was holding the um, slice tool the right way. I told you, your girl's brain dead. It's been a long few hours of writing the same bullshit over and over again. Um, yeah. Anyway. We good there. It's like I'm supposed to do a presentation and she's like, oh, just present it to your family and friends and then like reflect back on it. And I'm like, yeah, I'm just going to write a dodgy reflection and keep moving because ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so let's actually get into the days of the week and stuff now that we've got some, some foil on the bottom. Wee, 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 wee. Um, don't mind me, I'm slowly losing my mind today. I don't have a bow for the corner. I'm so sad. I have like that one on the sheet, but it's ugly. I might actually have to print one off later when I'm doing some other stuff. And I honestly don't. I didn't buy that um, bow sheet in gold, because rose gold, because I don't use it. And I know rose gold's a different color, so I just didn't buy it. I'm just going to use it, I think. Just be done with it. It's nowhere near the same, but it does the job. <sighs> okay, so Monday. Oh yay. Um, I have a nine o'clock appointment with my least favorite neurologist in the entire world. He's not actually like a specialist for my illness. He's just the doctor who keeps my script going. Um, for my treatment he's my favorite at least i've got his first appointment of the day so he shouldn't be running too late fingers crossed 
um, yeah. Look, he's probably really good at what he does, but he's not an MS specialist. And um, that's what makes me a bit disappointing because it's just frustrating when you have to go see other doctors to basically have your script written and basically go, yeah, there's nothing wrong with me. Can I just have my script, please? And all you'll do is literally like email it off to the next department, which is all that has to happen. Um, so I'll get a doctor script sticker out for that. I haven't got any other stickers like except the Glorious Gold ones. And then, um, Nana, Terry's Nana is actually going in for a semi somewhat procedure to check up on her illness that she was recovering from, from a little while ago. Don't know if you guys remember a while back, probably in January sometime. Um, Terry's Nana was really quite unwell. And, um, was in hospital and gave us a bit of a scare so I'm gonna put the rose gold for her and I'll use a doctor sticker for me so she's having a minor procedure done that day which is a little scary for everybody and then there's also a bill due Monday my health insurance is coming out now Andrea was saying that if you took your white out on the little thing and I watched this in her last video, if I can find my white out. And white it out over the little thing. And then stuck your sticker over it. It would help like get rid of the thing underneath. So I'm gonna try that today. So it would just be like a white background. If I can find the sticker I'm looking for. Which is in my bundle beside me. It's not organized, but it's beside me. There it is. So I've got these dollar sheets. I made them in all three colours a while back and I've never really used a rose gold. Um, so yeah. Get out of there. Get turd of a thing. And that way you can just sort of have it on a white background rather than like whatever's underneath. I thought, well, there's a, there's an idea you're a thinker woman. Um, so I'm gonna do that. And I'm going to leave the other one blank to hopefully put something else in there on Monday. But that's everything I've got for now. Tuesday um, is Terry's Telstra, Terry's phone bill. So I'm going to do the same thing again across the bottom. It used to be Terry's payday, but he's switched. He's working at the same place, but he's switched like provide like companies that he's working under like he was working for like one like provider and now he's working for like a different like company name I don't know it's, it's a long story but basically like he's gone up in the world and <laughs> stepped up in the world so he's changed contracts basically it's not anyone um so his payday shifted it's no longer on Tuesdays and Etsy pay normally is a Tuesday if you live overseas but for Australians it clears on a Wednesday so there are no more Tuesday paydays well, that's not quite true, but anyway. So Terry's Tales Tribune. And I'm having $2 Tuesdays this week. So I'm going to get a glitter box. And I'm going to mark $2 Tuesdays. I don't know with what, because I don't have any... I think I've got some really old school, like, SPC $2 Tuesdays. But it doesn't really work for my shop. Um, and then I'm getting my nails done. So exciting. So exciting. I have not had my nails done in forever and they're actually starting to look really good so by the time this video goes up I'll have my nails done and they'll be fancy so I'm gonna get a half box for that I'm so excited I um, found a nail tech who's really good and used the same product that my old nail tech did I was actually speaking to her and I was like oh, is this lady gonna be okay she's like yeah no. she's like she's fabulous she's like you will love her I'm like okay I'm like, yay, that's exciting. She's like, no, you'll be right. I have a nail appointment, so I'm treating myself. And then we have Terry's health insurance deducts on Wednesday. Another little thing down the bottom here, which I'm out of the screen. I'm very bad at that. I do apologize. So another little thing, a little bit more white out. I'm actually thinking, I don't know if I like it, but now that I've started it, I have to commit. So... I might just not do it next week because of the but I can see like why it would be handy but I don't know if I like it I 
think if they were, um, I don't know, it just stands out in person, but on camera it's not that bad. I don't know, it's more obvious with the darker sticker, obviously. I have PT and OT, not OT and PT, if we're going to go in the right order. I'm going to use a little sticker, I think. What other stickers have we got here, except for just that sheet? They're not going to work either. I might use a flag, I think. And do it like that. I'm not celebrating like Shrove Tuesday or any Ash Wednesday or anything. Like I'll, I'll acknowledge them, but like I'm not actually going to like participate in any like activities for them. Sorry, I put that flag down. Um, yeah, there's just, you know, not that big a deal. I'm not working in a Catholic school. Oh, are you serious, mate? I'm not working in a Catholic school. Yeah, you guys saw that on camera, what I just did. I think I need to make these scripts a tiny bit bigger. <laughs> I think that's the happiest I've been with the placement of those so far. Alright, moving on to Thursday, I have my fruit and veg collection. Sorry guys, it wasn't me. It's creepy. I actually have stickers that haven't been released yet for those. I should probably do those at some point since I'm using them every week. And this weekend here is the start of a long weekend for us, so it's going to be nuts. And Friday I have a makeup trial, first one for my wedding, I'm hoping that it turns out good, it should because the lady is lovely. Um, and I have that at lunchtime. And I was humming and hurrying about like which time to get it and people are like get it in the morning, you can wear it all day. I'm like but you don't get your makeup done for your wedding until like lunchtime anyway and then you wear it all day anyway. So <laughs> I'm just sort of like, yeah, I think I'll go with the lunchtime one because that means I don't have to like race down to like Bensdale. I can sort of take my time. It means I don't have to leave at like seven o'clock in the morning. So I'm kind of a bit happier about that. So I do actually have these um, little makeup stickers out from Fox and Cactus just because they were already out from earlier in the week. So I'm going to pop the little makeup girl there. It was the only sticker I had out already. I just saw it out. And I was like, I'll put that away. I'm like, no way. You need that for your spread. So I'm going to put down that on the Thursday next week that I actually need to film because I normally film either Thursday or Friday and I sort of just leave it as like a flexible kind of thing. But I definitely need to film on Thursday this week and that means I need to flip this one around. I probably should have undo, used the undo on this. No, nah, that's right. Um... I'm just going to use that little planner icon box thingy there. There's no cleaner this week, but yeah, I'm getting my makeup done there. We've got another bill there. That's the um, insurance for Terry's vehicle. The roadside assistance is due for the year. Sorry, that's on Friday afternoon. Popping it down here. Very important one to have. So if we get broken down, we can get help. Or if we hit an animal, we can get help. Hitting an animal is probably more to the point out here. Lots of kangaroos and wombats and foxes and all those other fun things. Yes, hitting kangaroos is actually more common than you'd realize and it's unintentional. It's not actually a deliberate thing. Um, I don't even know like what other stickers I've got here. Um, I've got headers, full box overlays, laundries, scripts, grocery shoppings. You know guys, I don't even have a weekend banner. <laughs> oh shoot. I'm going to have to use the one from the kit. I don't like that. You know, I am going to have to print myself some stickers. That's really sad. Alright, I'm going to use a rose gold grocery shopping trolley. Or a cart as the Americans like to call them. Ugh. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna have to like 
do me some stickers up I think because I really just don't have anything I'm gonna have to print myself off some basics like I just yeah there's nothing all right what else can I put in I need a sticker for the doctor just push that chaos away for a minute I need a doctor sticker. Where are my doctor stickers hiding? In the medical, I have two medical pouches. Like that's just like, I have one for just being sick and then I have one like of just doctors. Like that's pretty sad. Oh, and then I have a third one that is just like full of like um, spoonies, like characters that are like spoony characters. I don't like this guy and I don't have any mean doctors neither. Oh, I've got zombie nurses. But like that, even that's rude. Rude to the doctors. I'm just going to use like a, a coffee monsters emoji because it's the most neutral of them all. It's just a neutral thing, guys. Neutral. And I need my hair washing, little guys. And off the top of my head, what else do I need? I'm just gonna have a quick flick through while I'm here. I can't think of anything else that I need. Oh, we might do a bun run. So we're not doing, we haven't done one the last week, so we'll do one next week, I think. We had some in the freezer, so we decided not to. I think that'll do for now. Alrighty, so. We'll go my doctor's appointment, which I'm making Terry come with me for. That's like how much I, sorry guys, I was off camera. That's how much I dislike this particular doctor. Like I make Terry come with me. I never make Terry go anywhere with me. Like that's how much I'm disliking this, this male doctor. And it's just, yeah. Laundry. I know I need to put my um other scripts in my box there. I need a bun run sticker and I need to put my YouTube sticker in. I haven't been doing those lately and it's making me forget. And I'll need to make a weekend banner. Well, I'll need to make myself some weekend banners. There's that one there. And bun run almost sounds like fun run. Um, I think I'm going to use like this little box here with the bow on it. But I'm going to cover the bow because, you know, that works. And we'll put bun run there. And um yeah, I'm definitely gonna cover the weekend, do a weekend banner. I just don't like the look of that. It's gonna have to sit like over something, and I just don't like that. To become too snooty and used to clear ones. Okay, I think that's everything. I know I haven't put a payday in, but I honestly don't know where now like paydays are now, so which is a bit sad. So, what I think I'm going to do is just put the deco in. Um, and I'll do that on camera. Some of it's actually quite large. So, what I'm going to do is like put some of the bigger deco. I like to cover the white out. Just because it hides the... Um, it stops it from like coming off later on and then I'm going to put some glitter foil some foil and stuff in as well I like to place like the big objects first like I've said before there's a lot of big objects here I'm gonna, and I'm gonna leave Ash Wednesday in I don't normally leave the holidays in but I don't actually have anything to, for that holiday to cover, so I don't actually like where that one's placed. I do love coffee. Let's put that sticker down.
I almost want to put the kitty somewhere. I might actually leave the kitty because it might be good to fill up some space later in the week. Same with the girl. That's what I like about some of the bigger deco in these kits is it can be really handy to come in later on when you're trying to fill up space in your spread. My wrist doesn't want to bend that way. It's quite annoying. I think it'll do for now, deco-wise. I'm going to get onto some foil because I keep pushing it around and it's not doing anything for me. So we're going to get a coffee sticker. I'm not going to use um, icons this week because I don't have all of them, so they're done. And trying to move all the stickers out of the way that we're done with. I'm a hot mess guys, a hot mess. That's done with. I need those still. I'm looking for the medicine one, there it is. This one unfortunately isn't on clear paper, but that's okay. It'll be all right. Nobody's going to notice, which is what I said, something. Alrighty. Let's finish getting this stuff out of the way. Alrighty, so we've got some full boxes here. So what do we want to put where? Not going to do anything on the weekend because that's always going to have stuff on it. Need one on there, so we're gonna put one up here. Oh, are these cut janky too? Oh my gosh, they are as well. Good luck. Oh, I was having a good run that day, wasn't I? There's that one. I think for this one I might do like the foil going from the bottom and then flip it around it. No, I don't know. Do you want to do the stars around the girl and the kitty and then the foil over the. Mm -hmm, dropping it everywhere, guys. And then like that way over the books. Would it look cute covering the kitty? What do you reckon? It's so hard to chill with. Or do I want to go like more condensed foil? No, I don't think I like those ones. Or do I want to put another bow? I think framing it might be chopping it off a bit. Because I don't really like don't really like um, school, but you know, if I did one there, if I did one there, what if I did none on the spread and just do glitter headers across like the middle? in like this speckle pattern which will sort somewhat match that which is by arctic paper studio you know what i think i'm just gonna do that and i think how many have i got one two three four five six see i've only got enough for two poop because i've got enough here on mine which they don't quite match because these are more condensed than that pattern there choices um, because these ones actually match this bottom washi, but I didn't use that. 
I'm thinking I might just do my glitter headers all over and be done with it. I'm going to do that off camera and come back. When you think you're recording and you're not. So basically, like I was saying, I've done my glitter headers and I popped down a sticker here for Etsy Pay. And I popped down a couple of stickers in the work sidebar that said design and post office. And yes, they will be coming to the shop. I just haven't figured out when yet because there's not enough time in the day. Um, so basically I think that's it. If you want to check out my full spreads, um, feel free to check out my Instagram because I've put pictures up with them filled in after the date always because people are creepy. And um, yeah, I will catch you guys another time. Please let me know if you enjoyed it and if you've got any questions down below. And thank you very much guys. See ya.